What's next? It's big. It's broad. It's next on Sunday. With six sections and pullouts, including glossy color fashion magazine, Elan. There's something in it for everyone. Next on Sunday, ask your vendor and buy it. Hello and welcome to Next News. Nigeria's president, Umaru Yaradua, on Monday nominated the first bank managing director, Lamido Sanusi, an executive with a strong reputation for risk management, to be central bank governor for the next five years. The Senate must approve the nomination and is expected to consider it, along with the renewal for a second term of Babatunde Lemo as deputy governor when it sits on Tuesday. Mr. Sanusi had widely been seen as favorite to replace the outgoing governor, Charles Chukuma Soludo. The Academic Staff Union of Universities said on Monday in Lagos that it would continue to struggle to improve tertiary institutions in Nigeria. According to the chairman of the Lagos State University chapter of the union, Kabiru Adeyemi, the suspension of the two-week warning strike on Sunday also allowed the union to decide its next line of action. He said the ASU president had received a firm commitment from the government that the process of signing the agreement would start immediately. A Lebanese construction worker and his police escort were rescued hours after they were kidnapped for ransom in southeastern Nigeria, a spokesman said on Monday. The two men were traveling along the Abab Port Harcourt Highway when they were seized by 18 gunmen in the state of Abia on Sunday, the Nigerian Security and Civil Defense Corps said. They were freed hours after. The Delta State Government in Nigeria has distributed relief materials worth millions of naira to displaced persons in the crisis ridden communities of Bamaratu Kingdom. In a statement on Monday in Mori, the press secretary to the governor, Linus Chima, said the distribution was handled by the State Rehabilitation Committee. Among the benefiting communities were Opwede Bubo, Opele Ama, Uborodo, Azama, Enokuraga, Igoba, Kunukunama, and Oporoza. Thank you for watching Next News. For more information on these or any other stories, please visit our website at www.234next.com.